Dress Week says this is our eight, eight part te- nine part nine part teaching yeah. nine parts you a lot to say on that one nine part teaching put on the full arm <laughs> of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes <laughs> come on now that's a nice photo of us back in the back in there did you have a beard there? Yeah, oh, beard yeah. back in the day. So anyway, this People is our teacher. People got many photos of the unbearded Ashley. This is you the know, unbearded Ashley. You know, when you had a naked face, when your face was naked. Should I tell you the truth about my beard? Let me just clear this up, clarify this before we go on to talk about this. The reason why I grew a beard was very simple. Um, I got my green card. Uh, I don't know how many, how many years ago did I have a green card? Seven years ago, something like that. Yes. And we're very proud of my green card because it meant I had permanent residency in America. So I had my green card. I put it in my wallet. It's actually like a driver's license. It's actually like a real... Plastic it's not, card. It's you know? not like green. And I, yeah, but it's like green tin. <laughs> anyway, I pulled it out one day. I'd been using it for like a month. I pulled it out one day and just looked at it. I thought, yeah, United States from America. Very proud that I had, you know, residency in America. And I was it's reading it. It said name, Teradez, Ashley, all this. And then it said sex, F. F. And in my mind, I'm thinking, <laughs> there must be another word that Americans use because there's a lot of different words we found out from English English to American English. So look, yes, we've got do they, trouble numerous Have they got another word for, for male that begins with F? No. F means female. And in fact, I showed it to Andrew Womack at the time. I was working with him. I showed him that. And he, said, he said, it's your grade. <laughs> he said, it's your grade. I, said, I thought it was more of a B+. Plus. Andrew Womack, anyway. mighty man of God. Yes, that's, F, that's your grade, Ashley. So anyway, it's outrageous, isn't it? So <laughs> I realised I had a problem. I had a green card that said female. Cool. So it's just a very small black and white photo on a green card, like a driver's license, a very small black and white photo. Actually, like didn't Costco want to leave card. anything to chance. So Looked I grew that. a beard. So even on a black and white photo, surely, even though I have a girl's name in America, okay, I have a, a, a man's face for the black and white photos. So... I grew a beard and we reapplied for a green card. What was more concerning? Two things were concerned about that story. The first one was, is I had a medical exam to get my green card. He was examined and they found he was definitely I was a man. examined and let me just tell you, I don't go into details. No, Carly please don't, lied to please me. Don't. No, Carly lied please to me. Don't go Listen into to this. Details. If you're American, uh, give thanks. Because I, we, we, we felt God called us to stay here, so we had to get our green card. So I had to go for a medical and they gave me a gown and they said, put this gown on. And I said to Kyle before I went, because I'm not great with medical things, I said, look, what's going to happen in this medical? They said, oh, they'll just take your blood pressure, that's it. I was like, okay, no problem, I can do that. Well, I, I knew if there, I told him the truth, he wouldn't go. My two fears <laughs> about doctors or, or, or hospitals is the needles and the nakedness. It seems to me, whenever you go to the doctors... You didn't want his or, dignity to be exposed. I'm telling you, whenever you go to the doctors <laughs> or the hospital, they're, they're, they're just, they love getting you naked and, and that little, giving you a needle. And that little gown they give you... I'm like, that doesn't cover anything, it's just a, so you know. It's a big gap in the back. He so needs anyway, to wear two of them, one the other way around. They gave me the well. gown, they gave me the gown, and the, she, the, she said, there's a woman that's, you know, strip off. I'm like, oh, Lord. <laughs> so they they examined me for diseases, even though I said to them, if I've got any diseases, I've been here five I've been years, here five years already. So let me just put it this way. They examined me for the green card purposes. In fact, you know, they gave me a, a TB test. And I said, we listen. to prove that we don't have, I said, have t- tuberculosis. In England, I think South Africa's own, a lot of countries, Commonwealth countries. In England, we have the inoculation for TB. Everyone gets it when they get it. They get it when they're a child, like 12 years old. So I said, I've got the inoculation. So if you test me, I'm going to prove positive. And they have to test you anyway. Because you have antibodies. So they tested me and I had a big I've old tested, swollen. I've tested positive for faith. You've tested positive faith. Well, okay. you got that from Brother Jesse Duplantis. We love Jesse and Kathy. So, big old thing. So, it then they got all the doctors Christian around. Anymore. And they said, no. I was, they got the doctors around and said, oh, look, that's what a positive test looks like. Then they did the x rays on me and said, oh, you haven't got TB. I said, for surprise, well, we surprise. We told you that. So, anyway, I say all that to say. They examined me and they still put female on the, on the green card. And yes. second of all, I travelled through airports with that green card. People looked at that green card, saw female. They probably just thought you were confused. <laughs> <laughs> Nowadays. They're probably not allowed Nowadays to ask. It's perfectly they might acceptable. not be allowed to ask. So anyway, I sell that to say, that's why I got a beard. And also, he I like... covered his naked face. It's nice not having to shave. Kylie didn't like it at first. Let me tell you a little secret, viewers. Kylie didn't like it. She said, I don't like it. When are you going to get over that this beard face? This is some deep revelation we're going through When here. are you going to get over that beard face? And then she prayed about it. I said, go to prayer. And she prayed about it. And she said, Jesus likes it. Because Jesus had a beard. Jesus had a beard. Dress for success. <laughs> Free to you. Has nothing to do with Digital being Digital download. <laughs> Armour of God, you need this to succeed. I'm telling you, this will help you succeed in life. Go to terrorismministry.com store. Click on Dress of Success. 
MP3 audio download. The code is not on my watch. Come on. One word. Not on my watch. We should make the codes. Some people are still no, no. laughing about that. Let's do this. <laughs> Greek I am a Mao now. And just to clear things up, they oh, gave he's me. all a, man. They, I can confirm. Come on. They gave me a new green card. <laughs> Carly, they, Carly, it's outrageous. She's getting hot over here. So, okay, hang on. I'm using the confession card for a whole lot of Fan yourself with a confession yeah. card. You can get an, I got a new green it's card one, that said Mao on it. It said Mao on it, M for Mao. And then we got our citizenship. And our citizenship is definitely, I'm a man. Are you done? I'm a But I will say, with the name Ashley, a lot of people get confused and think Carly's Ashley and I'm Ashley. In England, Ashley's universal. Here in America, it's mainly women. You know, you were named. After a man from Gone with the Wind, I think your mum's on here. From Gone with the Wind, listen, you can confirm this. I'm telling you that Ashley was named after the man Ashley in Gone with the Wind. Big strapping guy, I believe he was. Oh. Good looking. Have you, have you watched that's that? No, I haven't because it's like three and a half hours. Ashley, it's a really long, Ashley. that's it. It's a really long film. I think Sorry, it's based in I thought, Georgia. Was it? Is that Scarlett? What's her name? Ashley. So, 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 I should try that when I Yellow Rose says, Ashley. What have I missed? Oh, you've missed oh, plenty. Oh, so much. <laughs> you never know what's going to happen with Skin Side. Life you changing never know revelation what's gonna happen. about the story behind Ashley's beard. You Praise the Lord. don't want to miss this. So, there you go. Anyway, anyway, we are looking at, not on my watch, the Bible verse we're using is 2 Kings. It is. That's what watch. we're going to be doing. 2 Kings 4. 4. Let's get your Bible ready. 2 Kings 4. It's not going to be about the, the widow woman and the oil Scholar because we already heart. covered that. Thank you. We cover the wooded woman, the oil. There's a lot of unisex names in, in America. They have Kim, Kelly, Lynn, Tracy, Sharon, Stacey, Stacey, Sharon, Jeremy, Jamie. So there's a lot of unisex names in okay. America. Yeah. Why did they give me such a hard time about being called Ashley? I don't know. The worst what? one was Why? DMV. They said, Ashley, Ashley Terrades. And I stood up and she said, you're Ashley Terrades? I said, yes. And she like looked me up and down. And she, said, and she went like this. She went, but you're a guy. And I was like, yeah. She said, are you sure? And I was like... Welcome to Ashley's therapy session. There you go. I'm just ranting. Thanks for listening to me. I need this. I mean, <laughs> next time I think I just lay on a couch and I'll just... If you're confused about your Thank name you. or your sex, write us. Come on, come on. No, don't. Don't do that. Don't do that. So, <laughs> Leslie Howard played Ashley. Thank Jay's you, Donna. Saying, which restroom do you use now when you shop? <laughs> <laughs> you started this. It only happened one time, okay? It only happened one time. Oh, my God. But the reason is, is because oh my the Walmart we go in, okay, the, so uh, the men's are on the left and the women's are on the right. That's just, like, standard, right? We went to a different Walmart the other side of town, and I said, okay, I'm going to the restroom. And I walked in, and I'm so used to women, men on the left and women on the right. I went like that, and as I walked down, I was like, hmm, a lot of stools in this Walmart, a lot of stools. And I was like... Where's your urinals? And then I realised, shock horror, I'm in the women's bathrooms. You should just tell them my name's Ashley. I just declared publicly that I walked into the women's bathrooms. In Target, that's not a problem. They don't mind so that, apparently. so much trouble. What, how did we even get here? No, we didn't get there. How did we get here? Anyway, we, there's no we in I ran out quickly and went into the this men's really restroom. Funny. But I'm just telling you, it can happen, okay? It can happen. Anyway, so, Carly, I'm read these testimonies you know before I get in any more trouble. Before, before, before trouble. you incriminate yourself okay. any further. Tea time in the terror desert, you never know what you're going to get. Carly, Press testimonies. Press share now. We love now he's testimonies. done ranting. Yes. Do it now. Now. Share on Facebook. Thumbs on uh, YouTube. Thank you very much. Carly, go ahead. Now it's safe to share. <laughs> now it's going to be PG, I promise. Okay. Testimonies. We love hearing your testimonies. Send us your testimonies. <laughs> Believe it or you not. You made me cry. <laughs> you know what? You're going to get some Alice Coopers. I know. With your mascara running. Do you remember Alice Cooper? Listen, believe it or not, uh, laughter does good like medicine. There the you go. joy of the Lord is your Come strength. On. And tea time with the terrorists. This is the vital part of the program. We don't plan this it. Is it. This is how the medicine it happens, goes down. It happens organically. 